all male. Gigi and I, of course, have a vagina. <laughs> Crucify us for that sin. So anyway, we're sitting at a table, and the waiter refers to the whole group constantly, all night, as gentlemen. And I'm like, okay, look, I get it. Maybe the first time you make a mistake, you're waiting on a lot of people. I've done it myself. It, you get confused, you get distracted, you're busy, whatever. That's all right. Second time, he says, again, gentlemen, how are you enjoying your fucking meal? And I'm like, I'm no fucking gentleman. So I think, okay, that's it. That is definitely the end of that nonsense, right? No, no, it wasn't the end of that nonsense. Third time he comes in. Gentlemen, did you enjoy your fucking meal? At which point, my darling hero, Gigi, said, stop talking. <laughs> Gigi, we have a long way to go, mama. I love you, I respect you, I see you, you are not invisible. This one is for you, and it's for me, and it's for all the women in the audience that have ever had to sit through such an indignity.